Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to a brand new Minecraft video. Kind of. The other day, I was scrolling on YouTube when I stumbled across this video, where another Minecraft YouTuber made an entire RPG Minecraft game. Yo, this is crazy. That is smooth. And honestly, I want more updates for the game. The game was made by one person, so they need a lot of support in order to make more updates. So really, I'm making today's video for me. So you guys go check out the game, and I get more updates. Let's check it out. RPG Craft. New game. Another day, another opportunity to look for adventure. All right, these are all the controls. Pretty simple. So, oh, oh, what's up, Steve? Why does Steve have a donk a donk on his butt? He is double cheeked up. So we can click in order to interact with things. And we could also flip around the camera. That is smooth. I really don't want to break the game. All right, how do I get out of here? Can I walk through the door? Ooh, a chest. There's an iron pickaxe. Time to mine. Let's grab that. And I think our currency is doubloons. I like it. Okay, let's go outside and let's see what the RPG Minecraft world has to offer. So as you guys can see, this looks amazing. This is one of the coolest Minecraft fan-made games I have ever seen. Let's click on the sign here. Steve's house. Well, at least it's canon. Looks like there's a chest down here with the sword. It's dangerous to go alone. Okay, so we have a sword and a pickaxe. Two essential Minecraft items. I wonder if I could talk with the villager. What's up, dude? Hello, Steve. I'm the farmer. What do you do? Oh, uh, you know, just the good old farming. Nothing suspicious or anything. How's your day? All good. I have this buddy of mine, Jesse. He's been helping me with the job. You should totally meet him. Where is Jesse? Can I farm? I don't think so. Oh, I can also like click to move around, which is really nice. <laughs> farm. What's up here? Please do not punch the tree. Well, now I gotta. You got a stick. Sick. Can I do it again? Ouch. I'm gonna stop. Oh, cool. In the top right end of the screen, we have our inventory. So we have our stick. Stick. Truly the pinnacle of civilization. I mean, you're not wrong. I can't get over Steve's caboose. Oh, it looks like maybe there's something over here. This is kind of giving me Zelda vibes. What a nice view. Oh, wait, I can look around. Let's cross the bridge. Oh, wait, is this his friend? Hey. Hey, Steve. Are you still planning to leave the village and search for adventure? That's probably a bad idea. My buddy Stan wandered out and he died. Well, thank you for that little tidbit of information. What does this sign say? Pond. Pond? It is true, Steve. This is indeed a pond. What have you come here for? Looking for purpose? Fame? Money? Many people have come to this pond looking for answers and fortune. Are you one of them, Steve? Are you here looking for your fortune? Because that would be really dumb of you. I am literally just a pond. You can tell a YouTuber made this game. There was a house up here, wasn't there? Let's go inside. Hey, what's up, man? Hey, Steve. I need to pay rent this month. Is there any chance you could get me another emerald from the cave? Quest added to your journal. Dude, it actually is an RPG game. We have quests. These are my quests. Find a way to obtain an emerald from the cave and bring it back to the villager. I can do that. What is this? It's a capybara. I don't know why I use the villager voice there. You gently pet the capybara. He seems to like it. That's so cute. Okay, we need to find that emerald cave. Cave. That checks out. You can go in. It's all right. I'm sure you'll be fine. Why do I feel like I'm gonna die? Hello? Oh, the music changed. It is so crazy to me that only one person alone made this entire game. Like you would think that at least a five-man studio made this. Entrance to the cave. Go further if you want. It kind of is giving me like Undertale vibes. We're gonna go deeper into the cave. Oh, wait, there's a zombie. Uh, what's inside of the chest? You found a hundred doubloons in the chest. Sweet, can I mine this? I need a pickaxe for this. How do I equip it? Do I, oh, oh wait, I can put it in my, in my hand. Uh, uh, right hand is a sword. Wait, it actually shows up in my hand. Uh, can I mine this? Yes, we got an iron ingot. What's inside of the chest? The chest is empty. That's unfortunate. Can I fight this guy? We're battling a zombie. Um, oh wait, I forgot. Okay, so it's turn-based combat, which means that walk as close to the zombie as I can and then hit T to end my turn. Okay, so they damage me, but there's another zombie coming. I can attack. I do a lot of damage. Wait, I'm gonna stay right here. I think the zombie can probably only move the same amount of blocks that I can. So that should be good. Okay, now I can walk forward and attack. That's a whole lot of damage. Sweet. Is there something in the chest now? Still no. Onward, Badonka Donk Steve. What's up here? This game is honestly way more fun than it should be. Supposedly, they just added a brand new update where we can actually battle the Ender Dragon. Okay, wait. First things first, we gotta kill these zombies. Nice try, bud. You're dead. <laughs> do so much damage. There's another zombie? I thought I killed them. Can I just like go around the zombie? Let's see. Oh, we got an emerald. Why does the emerald kind of look like uranium? All right, I'll be back for you later, zombie. What else is in the cave? Whoa, wait, diamonds, diamonds, diamonds. You got a diamond. You could probably make something cool with this. All right, let's dodge the zombies. I honestly don't. Okay, well, that was short-lived. Where are they at? Zombie. Oh, it's across the bridge. Come here, buddy. Come here, buddy. I don't have to do anything. I can just wait till he gets close and I do 22 damage. Oh, crap. All right, he's on the other side of the bridge. Okay, wait, there's three enemies right now. All right, all I'm gonna do is wait at the bridge. Keep on coming, guys. Come on over. And now it's time to kill the ball. 
Oh, crap. Wait. No, no, don't touch me. Wait, can I kill him? No, no, no. Okay, I need to run. No, he still damaged me. Okay, it looks like we gain back some health after every single time we're done battling. Let's go back out of the cave and give my man back his emerald. What's up, dude? Great to see you again, Steve. Here it is. The villager has given you an apple. Well, that was nice. Seems like perfect food for the capybara. Oh, we're gonna feed the capybara. Hey, what's up, little guy? Give the apple to the capybara. Oh, did I do it? Recruit the capybara. Does it follow me? Does he follow me or not? I'm confused. I can't tell if he's following me or not. I'm gonna name you Captain Barra. I'll be back for you later. What is this? Monsters beyond this point. Be careful. I'm not scared of monsters. Wait, is that the village? That is so sick, dude. What? Look at the trees. Okay, wait. This is honestly bringing me back. I'm sure a lot of you guys maybe haven't ever played like an RPG game like this, but this is exactly how it used to be. All right, these kind of look like bird poop, but I'm guessing they're mountains. What's inside here? Is this like a monster cave? Maybe a monster tower? Oh, oh, wait. Do I? Oh, God, I got to fight. Okay. Uh, should probably flip this around. There we go. Now I can attack. It's Captain Barra. Yes. <laughs> Came with me. That's actually so cool. Wait, no, this game just got 10 times better. We could actually have pets. <laughs> I wish that he was following me, but I guess that was a little bit difficult to code. But the fact that he's actually like in the battles is so cool. Okay, I should probably do like a 360 every single time that I'm in a brand new area. Okay, we're gonna wait right here. You wait there, Captain Barra. Ow. Die. Let's grab our iron helmet so that we can always have protection. We'll put that on our head and it actually shows up in game. I am loving this so far. Okay, let's get out of here. Where else can I go? I think this is an encampment up here. Let's check it out. What does this say? Stan's house. He's dead. Oh, poor Stan. I guess this is a ruined village. Sorry about that, Stan. So if this is a ruined village, that probably means that there's zombies around. Let's see. This was a workshop. Maybe there's some leftover items. Wait, a crafting table. I don't have enough materials. Oh, so that means that we can find materials here and then we we could use the materials in order to actually craft things. This used to be a totally empty house. Nothing here. For fun, I'm just gonna check it out and see, you know, if there's anything inside. There's a sign. Yep, told you. Nothing in here. Just me and you. Actually, I'm a sign, so it's just you. You look so dumb right now. I'm gonna take that one on the chin. Ooh, a staircase. Hey, what's going on down here? Wait, is this a stronghold? So we actually can beat the game. We just need to get the eye of the ender. I need something to light this portal with. All right, we don't have anything right now, which I highly doubt because that's not really how Minecraft works. All right, I'm gonna make sure not to accidentally walk into the lava. My new quest is to find the Eye of the Ender. Just in case, we're gonna save the game. Tavern, we only have one bed left. Sorry. Also, there's totally nothing in the bag. Don't even bother checking. Yo, Steve, what's he doing right now? Steve, his cheeks are going crazy. Gotta make this man stop. He is a menace to society. All right, we might as well take a nap. So if I take any damage, I could sleep, and I'm pretty sure that replenishes all of my health, which is good to know. Can I walk in the back? Oh, oh, back here. Okay, yeah, that's what I went to earlier, which had the end portal. Good to know. I just realized we have a zoom feature. So I can zoom really far out if I want to. Oh my gosh. It looks so much cooler when you're all the way zoomed out. Okay, it looks like there is a villager house over there that I need to get to. So we gotta go up this way. We can go to the nether. How about that? <laughs> That's awesome. Still not able to craft anything. What does this say? Warning, big obsidian thing ahead. We don't know what it does, but it smells funny. So be careful, I guess. I will be extremely careful. Oh wait, should I like mine these trees? Okay, no, I can't. I thought maybe I just needed to get rid of the sword in my hand and then I could mine stuff. I do need to find one more stick, however, in order to craft something. Oh wait, there's a chest. So if I click on that, I think it'll automatically walk to it, which is really cool. So we're just gonna wait back here while they do the trick. We'll grab our flint, which is nice and sparkly. Oh wait, now we actually have materials that we can craft, right? We have the iron from earlier, and now we have the flint, which means we can craft. You crafted the flint and steel. Oh boy. We're going into the nether. <laughs> let's do this. Oh, the music changed up. Got a little bit more scary. All right, let's go this way. I saw the stronghold. There's a shop this way. Wait, I should probably go to the stronghold first because I have a feeling that we're going to be able to go shop and maybe that's where we get the eye of the ender. Let's go this way. Uh, let's go up. Anything up here? Oh, hey, what's up guys? Fight me. Battle me. Where they're... Okay, there they are. There they are. Captain Barra, welcome back. Oh, not a problem. I got this guy. Easy. And we got a blaze rod. Okay, let's make sure that we get one more just in case. I'll wait right here. Captain Barra. I want to leave this one to Captain Barra. He keeps missing. Get ready, Captain Barra. No, <laughs> he just hurt Captain Barra. Attack back. Perish. Yes. You got bit by a capybara. Imagine dying to that. Okay, there's absolutely nothing that way. We're going to turn around before I die. Now that we have the blaze rod, we should be able to take it on over to the shippity shop if I can find it, right? Maybe the shop is where I get the ender pearl. Oh, wait. Hey, what's up, guy? How you doing? Oh, you're dead. 
<laughs> it's a one hit KO every single time. That's awesome. Jerry's illegal pawn shop. Oh, hey. Oh, Jerry, you look awfully shady. Hello, I'm Jerry, the shopkeeper. Nice to see you. Hello, Jerry. Do you have anything interesting? Indeed. I have this diamond that I, I mean, uh, uh, got from the village with another just like it and a stick you could use to make some cool stuff in that crafting table over there. Can I have it? Buy the diamond for 100 doubloons, which coincidentally I have. <laughs> You got a diamond. Thank you, kind sir. Not a problem. Pleasure doing business as always. Let's go ahead and craft a diamond AK-47. I thought it was going to be a sword. Let's go ahead and equip that. It said it was deadly and shiny. Exactly what I need. And wait, can I craft? I thought maybe I could craft the eye of the ender, but apparently not. Okay, maybe I need to use a different crafting table in order to get the eye of the ender. Let's take it back through the nether portal. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to be going this way. Oh, wait, yeah. I am. Okay, this is that secret house where there are maids. <laughs> What's up, guys? Hey there. Welcome to the Cat Maid Cafe. Here's a gift for you. The cat girl gave you a gun. Thank you. Can I talk to you now? What's your name? Hello. Welcome to the Maid Cafe. What would you like to order? I need more men for my... <laughs> my adventure. Sounds good. We're in. The cat girls have joined the party. Yes, I have minions. Captain Barra will be in charge of the cat people. I think it's time to battle the Ender Dragon. Now that I have my diamond AK-47, I have a good feeling we're not going to be stoppable. Okay, so it should be back up here. Can I use this crafting bench now? Yes, we crafted the Ender Eye. Can I craft anything else? No. I actually really like that feature where you can only craft one specific thing per crafting bench. Let's make sure we save here. Now we can go into the secret basement. Let's see if this works. Yes, it did. Uh, that is so sick. All right, let's hop in to the end portal. We're about to beat RPG Minecraft. Before I even touch the Ender Dragon, I got to see what happens with the cat maids. What's up, guys? Can I battle you? They're like not even dangerous. There's the Ender Dragon. I feel like I should take out these things though, right? Can I fight them? Oh, there we go. One down. The Ender Dragon looks so peaceful. Delete it. Excuse me, sir. Uh, have some business to <laughs> attend to. Thank you. Oh, there's actually an egg too. A cracked egg. Looks like something recently hatched here. Is that the baby dragon? Hey, where's the mommy dragon? Let's get rid of that. This is the last one. Hey, dragon. The dragon faces you. Fight the dragon or pet the dragon. I'm gonna pet the dragon. Why would I want to fight it? You pet the dragon. It looks pretty happy. Congratulations. You beat the game. The portal is now open. Really? You pet the dragon. It looks happy. <laughs> we did it. We beat the game. Wait. Uh, did I beat the game? Where am I? Oh no, it can't be. Is this a what is this bed bay? Some sort of weird medical device. Is this not Minecraft? Hmm, looks like a vent. Hello? No, 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 no. I, we, we beat the game. Cafeteria is this way. Do I call an emergency meeting? Hello? What, bro? What? I have my cat maids. <laughs> it's Captain Barra. Let's go. Fight me. Wait, attack. Red looks sus. Boom, dead. What about you? Can I attack you? No, Uh, stay here. Oh God, there's six enemies. The dragon wasn't the real boss battle. Attack. Yes, attack. Yes. The cat maids really don't do that much damage. This was the real challenge all along. Die. Oh my gosh, I forgot I have an AK. <laughs> run, run, Captain Barra. Attack, cat girl. Oh wait, you can finish this guy. Good teamwork, team. I need to get Steve more involved. He's got the most OP weapon out of everybody. Fight him. Tag team blue. You're dead. 201 damage. <laughs> That's amazing. Fight him. Yes. Finish red. Finish blue. Nice. No, we're about to have a fallen soldier. Oh, I, I can shoot from anywhere. I guess it is an AK. Run. No, no, not cat lady. We did it. You made it, Steve. You finally defeated your biggest enemy. Your adventure is finally complete. That's it. That's the game. That was amazing. Make sure you guys check out the description and give the original creator tons of support. That way we can get some more updates. While you're at it, make sure you guys leave a like on today's video and comment down below what you thought. That is going to wrap it up. My name is Beck Bro Jack, and I will see you guys next time.